guys, it's Scott here and welcome to today's 6 p.m. content video. Hopefully, we're actually going to get something today because yesterday we got to 6 o'clock, started recording, and nothing was released other than the, what, foot 16 or foot 17 SBC, whichever one it is. Um, does that actually run out right now or is it out for another day? Because I didn't actually do it. Oh, it's out for two more days. So that's all that we got yesterday. Literally nothing else. So that was terrible. So... It has just hit six o'clock. Hopefully today we're going to get something much better than that. If you do enjoy this video, please do hit the thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed if you want to see daily videos and live streams. And here we go. Let's see. We are getting ourselves oldie but goldie. Earn a flashback player pick of Javinio or Svine. Who will you choose? Uh, it depends on their skill moves and weak foot, which I really, really hope that you have improved, EA. Otherwise, they're probably going to suck. Because S-Vine is base double three star. It's a, it's a huge boost on his card. Javinio's base is double three star. I beg... I beg, beg, beg that you have actually improved these. Otherwise, that would be terrible. Absolutely terrible. Um, do we get anything else before we look at uh, the, uh, the in-game stats and everything of those guys? Take sides, me uh, Mega Pack. Complete this challenge featuring Champions League players. Interesting. Throwback UCL marquee matchups. 80 plus upgrade. Was that there before? No. 80 plus player pick upgrade. Oh, not this nonsense. Right. Well, what I will say is if anyone is going to do a load of these packs and wants them to be in a video of mine, hit me up in a stream or on Twitter or anything like that. And we can do this because I'm sure so many of you are going to open these up. I personally don't think they're worth it in the slightest. I've never got anything good out of these, but I'll show you what it is just in case you are new to this uh, this kind of SBC and show you what you get for it. So let's go to untradeable, whoops, untradables, low to high, and just fill this in for you. So right back, you need 10 rares. So you can get away with one non-rare in this team. And I think you need 45 chemistry. So we can just whack in one guy that gives us a bit of chem somewhere in this team and we'll be fine. We can finally get rid of Pearson. Thank God for that. <laughs> Thank God for that. Uh, Chukwezi, left mid, Diaz, Cam. We'll go with Dos Santos. And then Striker, we can go with you. And that should be that, right? 45 chemistry, 10 rare players, exactly gold. This is the SBC. Let's go for it. So we're most likely going to get like 80 to 82 rated players in this. I'd love it to prove me wrong, but these have never been good for me. Here we go. 80 plus player pick. What a shock. It's terrible. This is why you should not do this SBC. I completely forgot. Honestly, I forgot that there was only three players that you picked from. I thought it was five. It's even worse than I thought. So I would not advise you to do this. They're normally absolutely terrible. Stay away from it, okay? Stay away and don't waste your coins and stuff on that. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to go to uh, this team. And we're going to quickly concept in... Svine and Javinio, so that we can see what these cards are like. So, Svine, from his base card, has gone up 17 ratings, 17 pace, 18 shooting, 19 passing, 21 dribbling, 10 defending, and 18 physical. It's a huge boost. Now, before we look at the in-game stats, his shooting, his shot power is going to be 99 on this other card, but his other shooting stats should be good. Pace is going to be good. 
passing is going to be okay. Long passing is going to be a little lower than you would like. Dribbling stats. His balance is probably going to be a little bit low. Same with his composure. Physical. His stamina is probably going to be poor. Although they have put it up to 92. Okay, let's have a little look. So. It's double three star. EA. I don't think you understand. Do you not understand your own promo? Your own foot birthday promo is about giving people five star skills or weak foot. Why have you not done that? I imagine Javinho is exactly the same. If they haven't changed Estevine from double three, I imagine Javinho is still double three as well. You're making these players unusable by not bumping those things up. It's literally... I don't get it. Like... It doesn't make any sense because some people will say, oh, it's because it's a flashback. But then they did, like, Aaron Ramsey. Aaron Ramsey was a moments card, yet he got a five-star weak foot upgrade. So why have you not done the same for S-Vine? I don't get it. How do I see... Um, who was the last flashback that we got? Bia Biani they didn't do it for either, did they? They kept him as double three-star. Is it just... You think flashbacks are the only ones that they don't change? Oh no, but Tarapt! Tarapt they gave a flashback, and they upgraded his skills from four to five. <sighs> okay, fine. I hate your logic, EA. It makes zero sense, and it's stupid as hell. But okay. S Vine's pace is great. His shooting is okay, but his finishing needs to be better. His long passing is trash and needs to be better. His composure is not amazing. His balance is not amazing. How tall is he? Six foot. He might feel a little bit clunky, sadly. His stamina of 83 is okay, but not amazing. This is not a great card, sadly. It's okay, but it's not great. So I really hope that this SPC is not going to be very expensive. Javinio is the other one. So he had an 82 rated card. Um, and he's now gone from 82 to 87. The so five base um, upgrade. Pace goes up by five. Shooting up by 11. Passing by five. Terrible boost. 10 dribbling, no defending upgrade, even though it's a 5 rating upgrade. And his physical goes up by 7. So again, double 3 star. Pace is great, shooting's solid. Long passing again, trash. Composure, poor. Stamina's much better. 90 is solid. But again... It... At least with s you're going to get good strong links, right? Assuming that they are in the Bundesliga and not Bundesliga 2. I'm not being really stupid when I say that, am I? s -Vine. Please tell me I'm not being dumb. Okay, yeah, they are in the Bundesliga. So he can get really good strong links with German players. Javinho is not going to get good strong links. Ivorian playing for Parma. I mean, you look at the strong links, right? You got perfect links to Esvine. Strong links, the German icons, including Mateus and Balak, who are incredible. Royce, Boateng, if you start in like a 3-5-2, I guess. Hummels, get that off the screen. Kimmich, his moments card if you did that. Havertz, Werner, loads of people have Werner cards on this game. More Royce, uh, Bellarabi if you play 3-4-3, three, three. Uh, Muller, Goretzka's card, uh, De Costa is a great strong link to Svine right there, Mateus Cunha actually plays for the same team, so that's another really good strong link, quite a few people would have got him in out of their uh, SBC the other day, 
Edgestein's foot birthday card as well. You got some really, really nice ones in here that are solid players, right? <laughs> if you did Luca Bacchio, he plays for them as well. What's Javinio got? So, links. No perfect links. Strong links. Drogba. That's it. And Drogba isn't even that good on this game. Maybe his moments is decent, but like these lower cards do not suit the meta of the game. He's not very good. So basically, unless you have Drogba, I don't really know why you'd do Jovino over Svine. We can do a, a very quick comparison of the both of them as well, like direct comparison. Without any chem styles or anything like that. Obviously, you could boost them up with chem styles. Pace... Obviously, Jovino just trumps him on pace. Get that off the screen. Now, the shooting is an interesting one because uh, you, you are having to boost up the finishing of Svine, whereas the shot power and long shots are so much better. And shot power is quite an important stat this year. The passing stats are very similar. Free kicks are better. Dribbling, you do have the 99 agility and balance. You got higher reactions, higher composure on Svine. Defending no one cares about. Stamina is actually worse, but strength is so much better. Aggression is so much better. I mean, in reality, both cards are incredibly average. So let's quickly look at the cost of this SBC and see whether I think it's worth it for either of them. I'm going to be amazed if I look at this and I think, wow, what great value. Here we go. This should, based on the price of Tarat, this should be at max an 84 rated team. Because Tarat with those stats, 5 star, 4 star for an 84 rated squad was incredible value. And they give us... An 84 rated team. Good. With a team of the week though. At least it's not outrageously expensive. Good. Because otherwise that would have been an absolute joke. Um, so this SBC is coming in at just over 50,000 coins. Which isn't bad. For that amount of coins. It's not awful. It could be much more of a rip off. At least they aren't making it like an 85 or an 86 rated squad, which would have been <laughs> an absolute disgrace. In reality, if you're basing that compared to someone like Tarapt, it should probably be an 83 rated squad. But 84 is not that bad. It's, it's going to cost basically anyone that does this SBC less than 50,000 coins. If you've got literally anything in your club, uh, it'll be less than 50k. So... I don't know why they've kept them at double three star, but it's EA for you, isn't it? So, hey, hopefully you enjoyed, and uh, hopefully you think that it's better content today. It's really not. But if you did enjoy this video or live stream, please do make sure to hit the thumbs up. Uh, if you aren't already, then please do make sure to hit the subscribe button as well, as we are aiming to hit 73,000 750 subs are only 10 away so if you're brand new please do hit that sub button and that would be sick this will be the end of the video we are going to be streaming for a little while longer but thank you very much for watching this hopefully you enjoyed it i'll see you guys next time goodbye